Hey guys, this is a fun video now. We have Delmo's second week in my practice from the boot camp, and we have a special bonus seven months later. He comes back because he has a little bit of problem after a couple months, and you guys get to listen in. Here is his first adjustment and his first treatment schedule, and you can see what's going on. Nice. What's the next pick Alan? Yeah, that's what she said. Good. Okay. Now Delmo's back. Seven months later, he had five good months, as he says, and the last two months he had a little issue. So we adjusted him differently. That nah, was better. <laughs> Delmo, what's the uh, experience last uh, since uh, last night? Well, uh, like I was saying, I took some medication, painkillers, to be able to go to sleep, and and of. Uh, to, it's just I, my mind being programmed to do that. So I'm gonna try to cut it down. Yeah, we're gonna try to cut it down, right? And cut it down and, and, gotcha. and just take one instead of two and just stay away from it as yeah. much as I can. Last night he was on the Balboa Pier fishing. He caught a halibut. <laughs> he said it had, he had to throw it back because it wasn't big enough, but um, caught a halibut, had a great old time out there. Uh, but his pain came back up a little bit, right? Correct. And so what have I taught you how to bring your pain down? Well, to, to, uh, Go back into the, you know, my uh, where I my shoulders. I was too tense. I dropped it down and just relax, close my eyes, and and the uh, pain seems to be going away. The techniques we showed him, he finally just goes, you know something? If I can't beat him, I'm gonna join him and just see what happens. And he actually worked, right? You're oh, yeah. able to control your pain a little more, right? It's all about programming your mind. Good boy. That clavicle, man, it's a piece of work to get around. I've never felt anything quite like it. When I push on here, this is me forcing shoulders down. True, and it hurts too. It hurts too, right? And so we want those shoulders as low as humanly possible. Good, there you go, dude. This body followed the right here for me. Nice. What's the next pick then, Alan? Yeah, that's what she said. Oh, gosh. <laughs> They don't have those jokes in Texas, I'm sorry, do they? Yeah, they do. <laughs> <laughs> Here, hold on, Liz. I know. Let me clear up. Yeah. He's a little tired on this side. See, I've been wanting to do this because that clavicle's always in the way when we just on the table. This feels much better to me. Okay. Good, sir. Let this go. Good. Okay. It sure does feel different, I just, and especially the right side that you did. Oh it was huge, gosh, yeah. It was awesome. And so what happened when you went off the drug, sir? Oh, well, I had, uh, I slept good. And? And the, uh, What about your pain? This ridiculous pain. pain. Yeah, yeah no, but the pain bed. wasn't there too. That's why I was able to sleep. I might get restless syndrome just about every night. It wasn't there like it used to be. Yeah. It's been an experience, honestly. It's been an experience. My pain level was like from a scale one to 10 when I walked in. Well, it's been like that before I walked in, like a eight, nine. It has really dropped down to about a three. So let's do this today. First atlas adjustment, guys. You guys see this first atlas adjustment? Good. That was a thud. I don't know if you guys heard that. I felt the relief. Uh, I adjusted this atlas yesterday for the first time, two times. Tell us the results of that atlas adjustment, sir. Felt different, felt real good. You know, two I'm nights in a row, completely off the medication now. Correct. And uh, how about the restless leg syndrome? Uh, the, the, again, uh, uh, I took no medication, and my wrist leg syndrome also was, was not there. Like gotcha. Been, like every night. And slept how you sleep? Good. Excellent. Um, you know, getting to know him, yeah, well, his amazing works, I mean, seriously. Oh, that's nice. My sciatica much. pain, oh my gosh, it was just killing me. And my personality's gotten a little better to the week. Oh, huh? yeah. That's what I told my wife. I told her this morning. I was talking to her. Hey, you know what? I've seen changes on him, too. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It, uh, yeah. Nice. 
I went out fishing. I felt pretty good. Fish out there from up here. I would say probably about five hours. Do, what would five hours do to your back two weeks ago before this treatment? Hurt, pain. How'd you feel in those five hours? I felt good. When you started to feel some pain, what'd you do? I go back to my, what do you call that? Na, na, uh, Namaste. Namaste. <laughs> By the way, he loves an Atlas adjustment. So normally I don't do Atlas last day, but this guy. There we go. Whew, that was a double. Okay, so before we start, Delmo. Namaste. Namaste. No mistakes. Uh, yeah. Anyways, it's supposed to be namaste, but he doesn't know how to say it, so he goes, no mistakes. I think it's hilarious. <laughs> okay, so uh, it's been a uh, great relief that I can say. I came in with sciatica pains. So I try everything back home. I'm in Texas and. Uh, surgeries, medication, injections, you name it, all kinds of therapies, all kinds of chiropractors and still was uh, was getting nowhere, still had my sciatica pain and uh, six months ago I had a knee replacement and it flared up my sciatica twice and so uh, I came across doctors, uh, I call him Dr. Ace, uh, I came across his videos on YouTube and when I started listening to the testimonies is when I talked to my wife, we need to go see this guy here. So, and I'm, we're very, very happy, very, that we came across you. And because uh, pain level, when I walked in, was a, a one in 10, I was like an eight or nine. Right now, two, three, you know, it's very low. And it feels good not to have pain. And without no kind of medication, because I was taking a lot of painkillers. And now I haven't taken no painkillers for four days. Oh my God, I forgot about that, yeah. Also, my sleep, oh my gosh. I'm getting some very good quality sleep also. And of, uh, Look at this testimonial. So nice. So uh, one thing that I have learned is that, like you say, muscle memory, which, which is true because, like, okay, I'm very tense, and now I need to learn to relax. And when I do that, I notice that my body, the pain starts like to go away slowly. No mistakes. No mistakes. So <laughs> I'm gonna make no that. mistakes here. That's so funny. So if you. Follow his instructions, Namaste. I can guarantee you you're going to get some Look at that, I love that. Follow his instructions now. He was a little apprehensive in the beginning, but now he's like, now he understands. Oh, yeah. He's drinking, he's drank the Kool Aid here. <laughs> yes, yes, in the file. And that's why I had a little trouble at first. Good thing my wife was here. She kind of coached me through it. She said, yeah. just relax and just follow the instructions. Good. Sciatica pain down both legs. You said it's how much better percentage wise? Give us an idea. Kind of oh, give us an idea. Gosh, much, much better. Two. Knee pain, knees still up and down, but. Yes. Are we any better on those, sir? Uh, yes, we, we got a little better in the knee. knee I had surgery. Uh, that's why they cut the nerves, they cut the muscles, and you know, I just have to go through this. Uh, but yeah, pain level has dropped down. Anxiety, have an anxiety? Oh yes, anxiety, restless leg syndrome. I was oh yeah, restless leg syndrome. Every night, oh my gosh, you know, I had a, I had a routine that I had to do, you know, put in oil, doing the massaging, and stuff like that. And, and uh, and it was something that, that was, was my training. routine, by the way. I was training my mind to do that. So here, Doctor A says, "Okay, we need to get out of that that routine, that routine, which I did." And yeah, at first I was like in a daze. Why? I'm gonna say a lot of medication. Also, uh, the adjusting, you know, uh, the cranial nerves. I mean, it was oh my gosh. That's the uh, carpal tunnel. The um, no, no carpal tunnel. I had a little, uh, uh, like a little uh, tightness in the, in the morning. I noticed that too. Oh, oh my gosh, in the morning I wake up with my numb, my fingers will be numb. And uh, it was painful when you don't have no circulation. Ever since uh, Dr. A started working on me, it's heartburn I was, I was getting and also and that really helped me a lot also. So really no more heartburn, huh? No more heartburn. Constipation? We have a Yes, oh, constipation, also great. Yeah, really. Uh, you know what's so funny? He's like, my sciatica, Dr. Daryl, you did a good job. You know, I feel so much better sleeping. But constipation! <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> Everybody always gets happy when they poop. Oh, yeah, yes, yeah, because constipation is very important. I've been in the wellness industry. I work with Enagic, their office out here in Torrance. It's a machine that ionizes your tap water, mixed into alkaline antioxidant water. Very, very amazing. I've been consuming this water for close to 11 years now. You can go to mycongampro.com. This left clavicle still an issue. It gets in the way, still very tight on this side. Let me get him a good adjustment here. Oh man, that side didn't want to go. Whew. You can feel the tension in that sucker. No mistakes. 
See, we worked, the interesting thing with um, Domo is that uh, everybody has a different cue, a different thing that um, works better for them. And so it took us a couple days to find the right verbiage for him, and no mistakes is the best one for him. Oh yeah, <laughs> sure is. It's all about muscle memory. You just gotta relax it. And just follow the instructions. Things will fall in place. Okay. Give a shout out to your wife for making you stay. Yes, uh, I want to thank my wife. Yes. She, if it wasn't for her, I wouldn't be in here. Yeah, she, well, she's the one who talked to Liz. Yeah. And uh, I talked to her too, and she was very supportive, uh -huh. and she supports this man, loves the hell out of him. Um, thank God for our wives that like us. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Very much. Okay, here very thankful. Thank you. Wonderful. Wonderful experience. I like yeah. this guy too. Uh, <laughs> I like all my patients, but we had this was a really great um, two weeks. Great, great. We'll be here. We'll be coming every year. Yeah. He came in seven months ago. How long did that feel good for at home? Two months, three months, four months? Uh, I'm gonna, all, I'm all gonna run, yeah, I'm gonna round it up about five months. Now, how bad is it right now? From a scale one to ten, I'm, I'm gonna say probably about a nine. Sciatic. Also having trouble sleeping. And so you also tried to go to your local chiropractor there, and. Uh, nothing. Nothing. So go ahead and bend over to the toes. Tell me how that feels in your back. This pain when I'm going down. How much pain? Oh, well, one to ten, about eight. Nine. Back like this, sir. Oh, how much like pain is that? Pain. Pain. Right there. Right, scale one to ten. What is that? Ten. My knees. Oh, how much right my knees? That's it. Oh, my knees. How much? Uh, Five, six, eight, eight. Ten, eight. What about your back? Oh, my back eight also. I was checking his chart, his atlas what I did last time. We're gonna go right into Atlas and I have three days. We're going right in. This one. Good. Wow. You miss me? Oh my gosh. <laughs> You're twisted, but oh God. A lot of movement, huh? Yeah, I should have good. You should have what? I should have just relax it. I'm a little tense at all. Yeah, you relax. are. Wow! See, the reason he's back, guys, is because he hasn't learned how to relax his shoulders enough. We're going to work on that all week. Okay? Look at this boy walk. I'm telling you, one adjustment changes everything about his posture and his gait. You can see it instantly transform him. So uh, let's see how he's doing. I'm able to bend a little bit more. Mm -hmm. I'm not hurting that much. How much is the pain in your back now, sir? I know, but how much pain in the back? I was, I was like eight before a minute ago. It dropped about five. About five, right? I go back like this, sir. Oh, wow. Wow. It's pretty, it doesn't hurt. You come all this way for what? For the for shit. Relief. For, for the shit. For relief. For relief, right? That shit, for relief. <laughs> exactly. You find it everywhere. <laughs> exactly, find shit everywhere, right? Okay, so I need you to squat for me, too. Like, I, you know I had knee replacement. I don't right? care about that. How much difference? I just want to know the difference. Well, you, were, said, you, were, you were an eight a minute eight, ago on your knees. You could say probably about a five. About yeah. a five better, right? Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, Delmo, how, how are you doing the last 24 hours? Uh, much better. Much better. Pain level has dropped. I was about, when I came, before I came in, I was an eight or nine. It dropped down probably about a five, four, you know. Last night I was in so much pain in my neck. I put some ice and ice it down and the pain went down. Gotcha. What sleep are we, better. Yeah, good. You sleep, oh yeah, sleep. Tell us where you sleep. Oh yeah, sleep, sleep better. You said it's very difficult to make these changes. Why? Oh, because it's a habit I've been having, you know, the pattern that yeah. I follow, you know. Yeah. Like he talks to his wife this morning and says it's hard to change. And the only thing I'm trying to teach him is how to relax. And when you do, it helps. But see, he's not doing it right now. So show me relaxed. More. More. There you go. And you can make a comment on this guy's and go, how much worse does it look? It doesn't look that much worse. But he wants to be up here, and he needs to be down here. There you go. Good. Wow. That didn't go quite as much as before. Let me get right here in his atlas. Yeah. That was better. better. Oh my God. Yeah, that was better. So I had to put him in a different position because he's been suffering with his left side, I haven't been able to get it, so I had to change the orientation how I adjust them. So I'm going to also adjust this clavicle again. If you can see this, uh, it's hard to see, but yeah, I'm on a button. Yeah. Let's see my hairy chest. Well, I don't want to see that. So uh, the clavicle is supposed to go across here, guys, and you can see that's disrupted right here. It's a big bump right here. And that bump causes all these muscles to work really hard, and so I'm going to adjust right in here to try to set this, and you can see how tender that is right there. 
Oh, oh God. How many adjusted them? Good. Stay right there. I'm gonna get in here and work this again, Pec Minor right here, which he knows hurts a lot. Good. How painful is this? Very. Yeah. Do you feel this in your arm, sir? Oh, gosh. <clears throat> Breathe in your nose, out your mouth. And one more breath. Good. Uh, it hurts when you do the yeah the adjustment, but after I mean it's just like a relief. Yeah, I feel that you know, relief. Where I'm, is the relief in the shoulder? Or every, shoulder, 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 neck, also yeah. just like my much neck. more. Relief, this right. adjustment you did right a while ago. Oh, it's even better. Yeah, better, much yeah, better. Yeah, yeah. So again, I like to think I'm perfect at these things, but there's everybody's different. So I have other things to worry about. Old clavicle fractures probably a lot of arthritis that's altered because of his clavicle fracture, the way he moves and the way he fights. And so these things are um, things that I need to take into account when I'm working on somebody too. So I'll see you guys next time. So we're gonna go over your notes. We walked around the building and what's this? Feel, oh, feel like, uh, what's this? Million dollar man. Million dollar man. <laughs> feel good, no, seriously. I mean, I, I know pain though. Just, it just feels pretty good you know, yeah. when you're not pain. I drove sightseeing. I drew from Laguna Beach to Huntington, Huntington Beach. Beach yeah. Just stop and go, visit here, stop here, step And there. so pain free, but two. Yeah, but drop down to a, a two. How about two. How about the tailbone pain though? Uh, tailbone is still consistent. Consistent? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and the reason he has some tailbone pain, guys, is because he used to sit like this, and now I have him trying to relax more in the chair, which is changing the biomechanics of how he sits in the car, so he's just not used to that kind of pressure. As you can see and hear guys, Delmo's issue is change. He has these fractures and arthritis from years of doing things incorrectly and it's very, very difficult to change. When we had him for two weeks, he had more time to do it. He only came three days this time, but you can definitely see his posture is so much better again after three days. So I love this guy, he needs to keep working at it and I hope that he is still doing it when he's at home.